That's what it's all about. America's greatest bowl, the AutoZone Liberty Bowl. Now, I tell you what, we got a great zoo in this town, and we keep uh, our animals in cages over there, but tomorrow at the Liberty Bowl, there are going to be some animals out there on the field. It's going to be a bulldog. It's going to be an owl out there. That's going to be one hell of a match out there. At Rice, we have a proud tradition as a university. We celebrated last year our 100th anniversary. But it was also the 100th anniversary of football at Rice University. That first fall, when there were 50 men on campus for that fall, they fielded a football team to compete intercollegially. So that's the 100-year dedication of Rice to the sport of football. We are very proud of that history. But what we are most proud of, what we stand for, is the quality of our students, and in particular here, the quality of our student athletes. What they achieve on the field, what they achieve off the field, our sort of catchphrase at Rice is no upper limit, and that is what our athletes stand for and have stood for for the last century. And so if nothing else today, I want to thank, take this opportunity to thank all of our players and how you represent our university. Thank you so much. And then, I do want to say a kind of word about our coach here who's, 10 and three is pretty good. It matches the best record we've had in our history. But we are, of course, equally proud, if not more so, of the 100% graduation rate of our football players this year. That is what our university stands for. I stepped into really a tremendous situation um, with the commitment that our coaches have and our students have to success on the football field and success in the classroom. I, I just can't imagine a better environment for me and my family to uh, become a part of. And uh, David Bailiff, if you've spent any time around him at all, you, you very quickly um, come to realize what kind of person this is. There's an article that ran this morning in the Houston Chronicle uh, about David, and I encourage you to uh, find it. It's available online and, and read uh, all about this man, his family, and what he's done uh, in his coaching profession. And Joseph Duarte, who wrote the article, uh, called me a couple of days ago for a comment, and um, I gave him uh, a few comments, and, and he said, uh, he said, it's amazing that you would learn that much about David in your short time here. And I said, I, I think that's really more about our coach than it is about me. Uh, it's not my powers of perception as much as it is uh, what you see is what you get with this man. And that's why our kids and our coaches work so hard for him. Uh, David Bailiff is a uh, thoroughly impressive and honest and authentic human being. And I couldn't be more proud of him uh, and the leadership that he provides for our football program. Again, I'm just absolutely thrilled with the job that you've done with our program. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, the 2013 Conference USA Coach of the Year, David Bailey. <laughs> When you are fortunate enough to win an award like that, it really does. Everything at our university starts at the top. We have an unbelievable president who supports the scholar athletes at Rice. We have an unbelievable brand new director of athletics, and they have a vision of where we're going, and we're really excited about what we're going to be able to accomplish while we're there. We're excited to be here. Last January, we had 23 seniors. We sat down and said, what are you going to do this year? We encouraged them to dream big, and they said, Coach, we want to win the conference championship. We want to win the West Side. We want to win Conference USA. We want to go to the Liberty Bowl. We want to do everything we can do to try to win that Liberty Bowl. We built the pyramid, and we're out there. To be there with these young men, 23 seniors, 19 of them are fifth year, to have these goals still intact for us, you know, it's amazing. Uh, it's a tribute to 23 young men 
who some, and a football team that somewhere along the way fell in love with each other and made all the obstacles for us just to overcome them. And guys, seniors, thank you so much for the leadership you have provided this football team, and I applaud everything you guys have done. It is now my pleasure to introduce the Scholar Athlete Award recipient for Rice, who is Tanner Leland, seated at the head table. He is a senior defensive end from Katy, Texas.